Hey guys, Steve here, SAMTV. Hey, I'm out here with Jack and we were on one of my favorite trails here. This is in Holly Springs. Um, I, I love this basically because it's across the street from my house and uh, it lets me get out every day or any day I can get out and uh, just get a quick ride in, which is what I'm doing today. But just wanted to kind of point out and uh, mention a, a big part of riding is, is not just uh, bombing down huge hills and going over massive jumps. A lot of mountain biking especially if you're from this area of the say the Raleigh central North Carolina area is dealing with wet roots lots of roots and techy tight sections so uh, right now I'm gonna just kind of kind of try and point out here right through this section here all the way through here back and then back again there's all these tight trees and uh, I'm just gonna set up the camera here give you guys a quick view this is on a little bit of a kind of a kind of goes up down up so um this cadence is really important um you know just kind of dabbing your pedals um just to kind of keep your momentum moving momentum is the key on this kind of stuff i don't know how well you're going to be able to see it but there's lots of roots and rocks down here nothing massive but when you're going really slow you have to keep momentum going uh one of the key things i learned last year riding with a good buddy of mine that's a pro rider and deals with almost nothing but this crazy techie stuff and this is by no means anything extremely techie this is just a great drill for you find a nice tight section that kind of winds a little bit where you've got to negotiate your bike balance side to side keep moving navigate around trees and on curves and up and down all those combine to really help you excel and advance your riding in tight sections. So when you're out on the trails, um, for real, and you're not just practicing, you'll have those skills sort of like memorized and you'll know what to do. You'll know how to lean, how to push, when to bump and when to slow down. And, uh, and those are all gonna help your riding immensely. Let's check it out. There you go, nothing life-threatening, nothing absolutely astounding and insane. Just simple, simple skills to help you kind of just progress a little bit. To me, and in my experience, all I can say is gaining confidence is like 85% of the battle. You need the skill, no question. You need the endurance. Definitely you need the endurance. But if you don't have the confidence, all that training, all that endurance, it's just not gonna, you're not gonna attempt, and you're not gonna make it through the obstacle or the feature or whatever it is you're trying to conquer. So gain that confidence by practicing on small stuff and make your way up to the next piece, the next piece, the next piece. Next thing you know, you're on those features you really wanna hit and conquer and you're flying over them safely and with some real precision. You guys have a great day. This is Steve, I'll talk to you guys soon.